Exposure is very important in neck examination uh, and uh, I'm looking at the patient's neck, looking for any obvious scars, lesions or any lumps. It is important to ask the patient uh, to see if he is tender around uh, the neck before you examine the patient. Is it tender anywhere? So, okay. And then you stand behind the patient and first of all you feel around the parotid regions to look for any parotid lumps and then you examine the submandibular area down the midline to look for any lumps or bumps and then you ask the patient to swallow when you get to the suprasternal area uh, to feel for any thyroid lump and then you feel along the anterior border of the sternal pedomastoid muscles all the way up to the mastoid tips and then down the posterior aspect of the sternal pedomastoid muscles and then along the clavicle around the supraclavicular areas and then up the trapezius muscle and you complete your neck examination at the occipital regions to feel for any occipital nodes.